Hello and welcome back to Jenny and Games. Today we continue with our push to Christmas number one with another Christmas game. This time we're going to look at the great Christmas tree stacking game from House of Marbles. So what do you get inside the bag? Let's see. Whoa, lots and lots and lots of trees. Oh, and there's another piece in there. It's red. I wonder what that could be. It's Santa Claus. Of course it is. It's a Christmas game. Where would we be without Santa Claus? House of Marbles described this game as an exciting game for up to four players. Fantastic Christmas fun for the whole family. So what do you need to do? Well, from the bag you draw a piece. And the first four pieces have to set up the base. And each tree has to touch each other like this. But you're not allowed to put them flat like that. That's not a legal move. They have to be either on the side on the base or any variant of angle like that that's a base set up that's the first four pieces after that the following pieces get stacked on top of these again they have to be faced vertically but there are 23 pieces in the game 23 trees and one Santa. Let's have a closer look at Santa because he changes the game. As you can see Santa has only got straight sides. He's not got prickly sides like a tree but he does have a little bit of a base where his boots are. So unlike other games like Prickly Pile Up if you happen to draw Santa, you have a choice to make. The options are, if you draw Father Christmas, you can miss a turn. But you must use it on your next turn. Or, to add a bit of fun to the game, whoever draws Father Christmas must sing a Christmas carol before placing it on the pile. So remember, the idea is you've got to stack them up as high as you can. And the first person to let them all fall off is out of the game. And you continue until you're the last person standing. So let's have a quick look at how it runs. So we've had a quick uh, run down here. And Jenny's about to place one more piece. It's looking very precarious. So let's see if she can add another piece. Tensions mounting. This is a really difficult game. Oh, and she's failed. Santa's died. You killed Santa. Oh dear. Poor Santa's fell out the tree. I think we'll have to call that game there because we don't want to upset Santa. We need to go and rescue him. And I think we need to do a review and see how things go. Jenny killed Santa. She killed Santa. She let him fall from a tree. How could you do that, Jenny, to poor old Santa Claus? What's he ever done for you? I must be now on his naughty list. Naughty. Ho, ho, ho! <laughs> but we already know you're on the naughty list. I'm not. I'm a good won. boy. And I won. <laughs> Again. But anyway, enough about, sir, about naughty lists and good lists. What do you think? Of the great Christmas tree stacking game, Jenny. Well, I think 
you need to have very steady hand when you're placing the pieces. Oh yes, I agree the that that was the way to win <laughs> the, or not to lose. The pieces <laughs> are very slippy, aren't they, in this game? Yes. Unlike Prickly Pilot, which is also made by House of Marbles, I found this game a lot harder. Mm, yes, I agree. You can't play this on a slippery surface. Even on the uh, cloth that we used, we found it really hard. The pieces kept on falling apart. Yes, they, they, they did. Prob on, on my turn. <laughs> probably a neoprene surface or some sort of rubber, I think, is probably the best idea to stop them slipping apart at the base. Yes, I, I agree that's probably better. But, yeah. but what do you think so of it? Does. Did you enjoy it? Well, yeah, it's, it's a good, simple one for any ages to can play all together. And yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's a simple little Christmas-themed game. And it's nice that you get to sing Christmas carols. Because I quite like singing Christmas carols. You know, from anything from Silent Night to... Joy to the World. Joy to the World! <laughs> Joy to the World, the Lord is come. That one. That one, yes. Yay! <laughs> what else do we know? We could, we could carry. If I, we could do a video about Christmas carols, but I don't think that would go down very well. Yeah. Not on our board game channel. But it is in the rules. <laughs> but it is in the rules. So I might have got the Santa, and I have to sing a song. So it might be when Santa got stuck up a chimney, he began to shout, "You girls and boys won't get any toys if you don't pull me out." My beard is black, sot in my sack, nose is tickling too. <gasps> when Santa got stuck up the tree, then Jenny pushed him off Thanks. and killed him. He's not dead. No, he's not dead, children. Not dead. Don't worry. Santa is living. <laughs> he's getting all your toys and pretties ready. I hope you've been good, unlike Jenny. Don't get on his blacklist. No. But for any families wishing a bit of Christmas fun, this game is good. I think I would give it an 8 out of 10. 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10 for Jenny. Therefore, I think it's good. Yay! So please, subscribe, like this video, Give us a thumbs up, and if you don't like it, still give us a thumbs up, because as I said before, it is Christmas, we need some presents, and Jenny needs forgiveness from Santa Claus, so please subscribe. Subscribe, yes. Please. You said please. Please. Didn't I hear it? Please! <laughs>